What is going on guys? So today we're checking out the Fiaci RSL 18 reflex site. Now this is, um, a pretty nice site actually for your optics, uh, for your weaponry, uh, very cool device here. So basically you got five brightness settings, four reticle settings, fits a 22 millimeter Picatinny rail, which is awesome. Multi-coated lenses made out of aviation aluminum. Now, this reflex sight is actually really, really cool, man. This is such a cool piece of technology. Basically, a reflex sight um, is like a red dot, but, but a little bit different. It actually uses projection to project your reticle onto a glass uh, you know, screen uh, or a glass lens, I guess you could call it, right? Uh, to actually, you know, portray over the target that you're trying to shoot at. Now, uh, what it looks like is just like this, right? So you got your Picatinny attachment right here. You're gonna put this right on top of your rail. Um, on the back, you're going to have, let's see if we can get really close here. Right here, you've got all your different options for the reticles. So you can choose the four different reticles. You've got just a, just a dot, um, you've got kind of a circle one, you've got a crosshair, and then you've got kind of a, you know, more of a tactical crosshair as well. Um, you've got your different, you get your windage and your, you know, your adjustments here. So you can kind of make sure that it is ranged and, and kind of on, on target, uh, depending on the range that you want to get it to. You have a red dot attachment also here on the side. So you can push this button right here on the back um, and you get a nice little red dot, which is very, very convenient. And then you've got the actual device, you know, the, the main reason why we're here, uh, which is this right here. So we're going to go ahead and it comes with a nice little rubberized cover, which is very, very nice, very convenient that they package one of these with it. So it just slides off just like that. And now you can see there is your lens, okay? So basically you're gonna look down this, just like this, right down your optic, and that is where you're going to see the hologram portrayed on there, so you can kind of see what you got there. So there on the side here, you've got your different settings. So these are brightness settings. So you've got R, which is basically powered off, okay? Um, and then you can basically turn it to, you know, you can cycle through green, you know, brightness levels, you kind of determine the brightness that you're looking for. Um, and then you switch over here to the red side and you got your red as well. Now basically what this looks like, let's put it on red five, see if I can get this lined up properly. And you can look down and there on the projection is the reticle itself. Now I'm gonna put it on my hand and so you can see there it is, right? Now I can change the reticle by switching this little switch right here. Okay, so now we've got a crosshair just like that. Let's put that on there and see if that shows up nicely. Just like that. You got the circle one here like that. And then you've got just a dot. If you're looking for just a red dot like that right there, if you can see that. It's kind of hard to click, it's, it's hard to get this thing all focused in, but that's the red, right? And then you can switch it over here. Let's switch it all the way around and we'll switch it to green five and we'll switch it to back to the original one. And as you can see, now you've got a green reticle, just like that. So very high contrast with that one. That one zooms in kind of nice and sharp. Uh, but basically that's it. It works really, really well. Uh, very high quality optic. Fayachi makes really nice stuff, really reasonable price for such a high quality piece of equipment. So if you're looking for an awesome, uh, you know, um, reticle like this, you know, for your, for your optics, for your weaponry, uh, definitely consider checking this one out by Fayachi. Again, this is the Fayachi RSL 18 reflex sight. But guys, as usual, I hope this video was helpful for you and I'll see you in the next one.